The highlands of northern Ecuador is the home of breathtaking landscapes and diverse life. In the valley of La Calera is the town of Cotacachi, which is the home of an amazing group of indigenous women called the Sumac Muyo. Their name means good seed in relation to themselves and the materials they use to create their beautiful, sustainable jewelry. Sumac Muyo was created 12 years ago by a group of seven women. Their goal was to provide women in the community with their own income stream as a way to help support their families and the community. However, their socioeconomic impact goes far beyond their original aspirations. The act of making jewelry together provides women in the community with a comfortable atmosphere to de-stress from their daily life. Women from abusive homes can seek refuge within this group. Quality relationships are formed as they communicate their struggles, give advice, and encourage each other. These women are leaders within their community for social change and activism against issues such as domestic violence. They teach each other the technical skills of creating jewelry, but the designs implement their creative freedom. The jewelry is made from the nuts of the tegua palm tree and melon seeds. The seeds are dyed and then shipped to their workshop. When meeting with some of the women in the group, they went on to talk about the impact that Sumac Muyo has had on their lives. Their work establishes them as prominent members of the community. Flora Yepes is an organizer for the group and takes pride in helping the women and children of her community by being a resource. She is also a healer who has adept knowledge of the medical uses of indigenous plants. Laura Flores is a member who studies natural resources in the University of Ibarra. She says, We care for our culture and natural resources because it is the environment in which we live and we must keep it habitable. Magdalena Fuerez is another member who hopes that inequitable conditions for women will improve, that someday women will no longer depend on men. She wants the children to grow up to be leaders and not forget the vision of their ancestors, to not destroy the environment because, as she says, without the earth, we have no life. When asked where they see this group going within the next five years, they said that they hope it is still alive and even more vibrant. They want Sumac Muyo as a whole to advance and continue to grow by working together. They hope to integrate more diverse skill sets. Building their brand and generating sales will allow them more creative control and independence.